Hello, this is my On One DDR 2017 model. 27.5 wheels, steel hardtail. Got a little bit of flex in it. Race face bars and stem. Superstar headset. Rockstrox Revelation 140mm travel in there. SLX front brake. Dior, an old Dior brake, it works fine. Orange grips that need replacing. Now I'm running a charge seat post, very comfortable. Rockstrox reverb. Stealth, it's, it's alright, needs some maintenance though. Race face affect cranks, DMR V12, good grip. Oval chain ring, saves my knees under hard hill climbs. Now, on the rear tyre, tubeless front and rear, I'm running a Maxxis in the front. Alex rim wheels with Alex rim hubs. Now, SLX 1x10 drivetrain, works fine, live in Norfolk, it's flat, you don't need a 52. Hey guys, this is my uh, Diamondback Sync 2.0. Um, it's a really great bike as a dirt jumper itself. Um, so it used to be 27.5 wheels uh, and I changed to 26s um, to make it into a dirt jumper. It works very, very well. I love it. Um, so at the start, we've got a pretty expensive uh, stem. This costs about £110 new. Um, and that came from my old XC bike, uh, which I bought for £200, believe it or not. So yeah, it's a Thompson C um, sorry, stem and it yeah, works really well. I love it. Uh, so it came with a seat post which is about 80 quid, which is a bit stupid for an expensive bike. Um, well, it's not an expensive bike, sorry. Uh, and then we've got a RockShox Recon uh, RL Black, um, which is really good. It's got two different types of uh, compression on it and rebounds, which is lovely. Um, we've got some just cheap Shimano MT500 wheels, which is keeping it simple again, uh, which run great. Probably upgrade to some uh, Halos in uh, the upcoming future. But yeah, that works really well. We've got a Shimano MT500 uh, brake, which is uh, yeah superb, really nice lever. Uh, it's only two pot, but yeah, that's all I need. Uh, and they've got a DMR uh, chain tensioner, which is really easy to set up, no problems at all. And then a 160 rotor. And then the tires I've got for absolute steel, um, about 20 quid each, which is yeah, really good. All in all, very uh, cheap bike put together from some old parts and old bike. Hello, this is my Vitus Mythique 27.5, bought like a couple of months back, so it's 2020 edition I think, of Chain Reaction Cycle. Um, we're running, I think Magic Mary, hands down from the rear, uh, providing ultimate grip, it's super tacky. I really want these to last a long time because I don't want to buy some new ones, they're stupidly expensive. Got uh, Magic Mary up front providing ultimate grip, super pleased with these tyres, they set up tubers so quickly with the tubeless rims. Got muck off in there and it's just working the dream. Uh, well, Sham SX drivetrain going up to 50. Sham SX drivetrain, bit of dodge cam work. Um, going up to 50, tooth in the rear, 11.50. It's all right. Uh, you don't really need it in Norfolk, but it's nice spinning on nothing for quite a long time. It's pretty good. Uh, up front with the crank brother stamp tomb in metal, raw alloy. Looks pretty good. I'm enjoying it a lot. Um, they just really super grippy with O'Neill's on, on your feet, which is really nice. Brand X Ascend, uh, drop post, 120mm, 125 something like that. Uh, that's really good. I had a couple of problems with pulling it out and in because it's kind of like the cable comes undone, it gets a bit frayed, but I'm sure that's just a setup thing and I've, I'm used to droppers, so who cares. Uh, now we've got brakes up front, 180mm rotors on front and back, really good. I'm actually really enjoying it. I used to be on 160, so now they're really powerful they're seeing a big difference uh shimano 401s for the whole brake calipers and levers they're actually doing really really well loving them the levers are a bit weird they're two finger but i'm running with one finger and they're just a bit all right they're okay uh i think that's about it x fusion rear shock x fusion front fork sweep boost all that kind of stuff it's pretty good 140 mil travel um 140 in the rear as well so that's Okay. Uh, I'm back, so this is my brother's bike, he's a bit camera shy, so I'll do it for him. This is a long story, this is my old bike, it was in Thailand, so I stripped it down, flew it back from the, with an airplane, then he had it for a while, we built it up, and now we sanded it down a couple of weeks ago, and we spray, spray painted it, sprayed up bike, the paint job's so good, and we finished it off with a bit of dive bro in Hawaii, it's nice, 26 of wheels, it's quite short. One by Franks, V12, Shimano brakes, front and rear, Ragley stem, Brandex bars, <laughs> Shimano hubs, 
Continental Tires, Race Kings, Fast Rolling, Rock Shocks, 100 mils, Acera, 1x8, he's going to upgrade that soon. Yeah. So, another story. We used an old part from some an old diamond bag he used to own. We A lot of the parts from the diamond bag, it says diamond back here. But the old frame used to be a Bianchi Kuma 